Hi friends, it's Margaret Wood from Maggie's Kitchen going to prepare Bisibilla Bath. Uh, for that, the first step is I have taken 3 cups of rice with this. I took raw rice. Normally, I used Basmati Sela rice. But for this, we have to use raw rice. Uh, this is also Basmati raw rice and 1 and a quarter cup of Thur Dal. So I am going to wash this now. Hi friends, now I washed and added the rice 3 cups and 2 dal 1 and a quarter cup. So the water I added is 1 is to 3. So 13 cups of water I added. A quarter teaspoon of turmeric, 1 tablespoon of oil, uh, 8 garlic pearls, 4 green chilies and um, 2 um, teaspoon of uh, uh, coriander powder, homegrown coriander powder. So I am going to keep this for 15 minutes in the instant pot so it will cook very well. By the time I will cut and clean and cut the vegetables what I am going to add to this bath. Hi friends, the vegetables I am going to add for the visible bath is 2 green plantain, 2 potatoes, 1 pound of uh, radish, uh, 350 grams of drumstick, um, 200 grams of beans, 2 carrots, 1 lime juice and coriander. So I am going to um, cut these and cook uh, for uh, 20 minutes. But because the boiling point of these vegetables is 15 to 20 minutes. I diced all the vegetables and added with 3 cups of water. I will be adding about a teaspoon of turmeric and 1 teaspoon of salt uh, for this cooking. See friends, it got roasted like uh, not red color. It turned into brown. So I am taking this out and then I will be adding a little bit of oil with the, I am going to roast other ingredients. I added uh, 1 tablespoon of uh, oil and uh, uh, 4 uh, tablespoon of coconut uh, powder and uh, 3 tablespoon of uh, uh, gus gus uh, poppy seeds, 2 uh, cloves and 1 bit of uh, um, lavang and patte. Uh, we are going to make uh, some ingredients roasted and make it to powder uh, for this bisibilla bath recipe. The first set is without any oil. I am adding 1 tablespoon of chana dal, uh, 1 tablespoon of urad dal, 1 teaspoon of peppercorns, 1 teaspoon of jeera and 1 half a teaspoon of methi seeds. So I am going to roast this first and let, let me guide you in the next step what I am going to roast. The bath is ready now. I am roasting here uh, uh, the um, cashews and a little bit of uh, mustard seeds, a little bit of uh, um, curry leaves and red chilies. Once it roasted, I'll be throwing to it. The, the rice and the, the vegetables everything together. Now I'll be adding the powder I made. Basically, uh, bath is ready and it tastes very good. Smells very good. Um, it's a very healthy food. Mm, anybody can have this based on the quantity what they can have because it has complete lots of vegetables and dal and rice, ghee, cashews, all these all ingredients added to it. It gives more taste to the ingredient and it is very tasty. Uh, thanks for your watching and thanks for your subscription. Our home cooking is made easier, healthier and tastier. Bye for now from Maggie's Kitchen.